right, so are you ready to try some scallops? Absolutely. Okay, so we're going to do a scallop appetizer, seared scallop appetizer. It could be a dinner. I mean, you just put more scallops in it. Um, I dried off these scallops. And the other thing you want to remember is you want to buy what are called dry scallops. Yeah. Um, and that means there's no chemical has been added to cause them to absorb more water so they look plumper. Um, the other thing is a lot of them will have this little adductor muscle on it and you just need to remove that, uh, take that off before you work with them. And so I got that set up here. The only thing I want to put on here is salt and pepper. Okay, I don't want to insult the ingredients here. So we're going to do salt. We're going to do pepper. You see the pan is heating up on medium-high. If the pan itself is already starting to smoke, so I'm going to yeah. put the oil in, and we want that smoking too. We want this nice and hot. Make sure I put enough oil so that the, the scallops are in the oil, not sitting on not any open areas where they're sitting on the surface of the pan. Okay, I'm going to turn these over. Salt and pepper the other side. Pepper the other side. And then these are just going to go right into the pan. It should only take between two and three minutes to cook them. Um, it depends on how thick they are. Um, I definitely want to make sure I don't overcook them. So here we go. We got these sitting here. Nice smoke and oil. And uh, I'm going to make a little salad to go with it. And so I'm going to start with a very simple dressing, keeping everything simple. I got one part lemon juice, two parts olive oil. Again, salt and pepper. Pepper. And salt. Mix it up. And it's just going to be a very, very simple little salad. So I got that mixed up. Blend it up really nice. Okay. And then the salad is just going to be, I'm going to take a few thin slices off the top of some romaine. That's it. A little bit of that. A little bit of romaine. Shaved fennel. Fennel. Shave some red pepper. Uh, not pepper. Red onion. That's a little too much. We'll just put that much in. Okay, just toss that around. That's all. That's all there is to that. All right. Scallops are doing nicely. They're getting nice and brown. We don't want to turn them quite yet. I said it's going to be probably about, I said a total of about three minutes. This is just a little bit of salad that we put underneath. Well, you know, maybe we'll slice up a little more fennel. What do you think? Sure. I like fennel. Meanwhile, those scallops are going along nicely, so we'll toss that in here too. Here we go. Put our little dressing. Put the fennel on top like that. And these are looking like they're just about done I, on one side. They look seared. Okay, we're going to flip them over. Oh yeah, that's the way you want them. You want that nice crust, just like that. Let's flip them over. A nice crust on. I don't want to overcook these. They have a, should be kind of rareish, a nice uh, sheen in the middle. Then we're just going to finish them with a little bit of butter. Why not, right? Everything's better with butter. Put some butter in there like that. Baste them with the butter and oil mix. Again, we want to keep it simple. Don't insult the ingredients. They're beautiful scallops, right? So they're looking quite lovely and quite, you want to make sure that, that, that you don't overcook them. You want them to still have a little bounce to them, a little bit of softness. If they start to feel completely firm, they are overdone. So here we're going to put these on the plate like this and put these. Let's turn this off. Notice they didn't stick at all. That's the point. You know, you don't touch them. Once you put them on, you don't touch them. You make sure they get the sear. They shouldn't stick because, it, because they'll get that nice sear on. All right, let's finish them off. We're going to finish them off with the tops of some of the of some scallions. 
some pistachios for a nice little crunch. A little bit of lemon zest on top there too. And these are fennel fronds. You know, from that fennel, the fronds that were at the, on the top. Just to finish off with a little flavor. Why don't you dig wow. into those? Why don't you dig mm. into those? I'm going to dress mine up here too. You notice I did not want to put the mm -hmm. dressing on the top. I want to just put the dressing on and then pull the pull it out so it didn't wasn't soaked in the stuff. Well, what do you got there? You can drag it through the dressing, and oh, these are perfectly cooked. Nice and still juicy. Um, nice sear on the outside. Okay. And a little pop of acid and crunch. Really tasty. See that? Mm -hmm. That's the way you want them. You want them to have that nice little sheen still on the inside, mm -hmm. not overcooked. Mm -hmm. All right. So that's a little scallop appetizer slash if you made, you know, six for, per person mm -hmm. or eight per person, it would be a nice a dinner, dinner too. Yeah. All right. Mm -hmm. Thanks very much. Glad you could join us. Cheers.